Good to see you. What do you think no he doubt, killed him? He thought it was the only way to make his point. And also, because he knew he could. If it's the war you're referring to, I'm on the side of White Run. No doubt General Tullius and his friends in the Empire will tell you that I owe them my loyalty. And perhaps I do. Ulfric Stormcloak would say that I owe my allegiance to the Nord people as they fight for Skyrim's independence. Perhaps this is also true. The day might come when I am forced to draw my sword for one side or the other. But that day has not come yet. Hate to break it to you, but that day's here now. Did he now? <laughs> the man is persistent. I'll give him that. I suppose it's time I give him an answer. Proventus, what do you make of all this? If Ulfric were to attack Whiterun? As in all things, Lord, caution. I urge us to wait and see. Pray wait. I'm of a mind with Irela. It's time to act. You plan to march on Windhelm? I'm not a fool, Proventus. I mean it's time to challenge Ulfric to face me as a man. Or march his storm cloaks up to the gates. He'll do no such thing. A dagger in the back is all you could expect. He was rather straightforward with Torig. Torig? He simply walked up to the boy and murdered him. That boy naked. Was a naked, high naked, king naked. Skyrim. I'm not the High King. But neither am I a boy. If Ulfric wants to challenge my rule in the old way... Father says I'm too young to change the sword. So I practice with my fists. Screw him, kid. Cloaks to do it for him. True. He's already proven his personal strength. Now he seeks to prove his armies. Then might I urge you to consider General Tullius's request? I mean, if you are bent on offending Jarl Ulfric. Ulfric is the one who has offended. But... Proventus has a point. Ulfric has made it clear. In his mind, to refuse his claim is to side with the Empire. And what harm is there in letting a few legionnaires die in place of your own men? It seems cowardly. Was it cowardly, then, to accept the white gold concordage? Oh! That was different. Was I given a chance to object to the terms of the treaty? No. The Jarls weren't asked. We were told, and we had to like it. The chests of gold didn't hurt. Damn it, this isn't about the gold. It's time to decide. Lord, wait. Let us see if Ulfric is serious. Oh, he's serious. But so am I. Finally. So about this axe. You can return this axe to our friend. The esteemed Jarl of Windhelm has my answer. Make sure he gets it. Proventus, bring me my pen and the good parchment. Are we writing a letter, Lord? Yes, to General Tullius. I need to make a few things clear before I accept the shame. legionnaires up here. This is a nice town. It's a shame it has to end. Let's go. Yo, Lord. Lord Ulfric, please wait your response. Damn. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. I'm a Thane. What does that mean? The Jarl has recognized you as a person of great importance in the Hold. A hero. The title of Thane is an honor. A gift for your service. Guards will know to look the other way if you tell them who you are. All right, then. Damn! That shake was hot. Oh, it's good to be back, back in Windhelm. Alrighty, boss. 
speak with all. The Empire thinks it holds Valkyrie from us, but the souls of Skyrim's bravest are buried there and will fill our hearts and strengthen our blade. Then I was wrong about him. You're right, Dalmar. Again, I'm in no mood to joke. Give the word, my lord, and Whiterun is yours. Whiterun is only a means to an end. I've toured our camps. We're ready, Ulfric. Wherever you are. Is any man ever ready to give the order that will mean the death of many? No, but neither is every man able to give that order when he must. But you are that man, Ulfric. You've been that man before, and you'll be him again. And these men and women, they call themselves Stormcloaks because they believe in you. They are the meanest, toughest sons of bitches Skyrim has to offer. And they want this. They want this as much as you do. Yeah, you Perhaps appreciate it, brother. They want it more. You're certain we're ready. White Run's army will no doubt be bolstered with legionnaires. And those walls around White Run are old, but they still stand. We are ready. And I might be old myself, but I'll kick those damn walls down with my bare feet if you would only ask me to do it. <laughs> I'm sure you could do it too. All right. This is it. Yes! Send the word. A new day is dawning, and the sun rises over White Rock. Aye, and the sons of Skyrim will greet that dawn, teeth and swords flashing. So it begins. Speak with Ulfric. He's expecting word from White Rock. Make haste to our camp in White Rock. I want you on the front line. I have a feeling about you. Your place is on that battlefield. I need you there. Sir, yes, sir. Fight well or die well. Talos be with you. Let's get going. Yep. Time to kill some sons of bitches. Let's finish this. This is it, men! They say that our cause is false, and that we are nothing more than thieves, thugs, and murderers! We are farmers! We are craftsmen! We are sons and daughters of shopkeepers, maidservants, and soldiers! We are the sons and daughters of Skyrim! And we have come this far because our cause is true! Because we fight as one! And because our hearts are bursting with anger. What we do here today, we do for our country. For all the true lords of Skyrim. White Run's walls are tall, but they are old and crumbling. Like the Empire whose legion lines them. They and the Imperials behind them. Our objective yeah. is the draw bridge. If we can find a way to drop it, the city will be ours. Everyone on me, let's show these Imperial milk drinkers what true lords look like. Yeah. Still here.
Let's do this. I surrender. Give me a convenient position to hold now. But mark my words, old man. In the days to come, Ulfric will spread his rebellion thin. And what then? We need the Empire as much as it needs us. We Nords are the Empire. Our blood built it. Our blood sustains it. You of all people should know that. Tell me, Vignar, was all this worth it? How many of those corpses lining our streets wear the faces of men who once called you friend? What about their Over families? Here. Over here, someone do There is a burning city out there that needs a government. He's right. Galmar, come. Let us listen. Over there? I surrender. Please. Give me a few hours to get to my household. This isn't over. Hear me, you old fool. This is better of you. You'll all come to regret this day. Get over to I'm the I'm pretty sure I killed yeah. more than you. I was counting. 
You're going to freeze to death. Let's do this. My y'all, we have returned victorious. We've driven the Imperials out of White Run. This is good. Very good. We now control the center. It's a powerful position. One I aim to keep. We'll call you Ice Veins now. For the thick blood of our land has seeped into your heart. Here, take this. It's an Imperial Officer sword. A fitting weapon to use against our enemy. What's the next move? I suspect you'll be of greater use to us with greater freedom. So you're free to engage the Imperials as you see fit. But I also want you to find our hidden camp in Fort Reaper. Dalmar will have special tasks for you and will need you when we liberate the capital. Understood. Go with the gods. Oh, I'll go with the gods, alright. Right before I plant, right before I kick them from their thrones and take their place.